Hi, this is Peter from the FlexiFold team. Today I'm going to show you how to install a FlexiFold 2 blade composite propeller on a sail fly. There are a few things to be aware of, so it's very important that you start reading the installation manual that follows in the box when you buy the propeller. One of the things to be especially aware of is that this is the one carrying the load in the propeller and you need to have the bolts installed correctly as you see it here. I will get back to that. First we need to install the hub. Very important is to be aware that you have the spacer on your sail drive ready before you install the hub. goes right into the sail drive. And then we mount the nut. Like this. And then you have to torque it with around 70 nm. And you can use this one too. Nice to be two persons here. Then we install the tap washer with the little bolt. Very important is to lock the tap washer both ways, both on the nut um, for the hub and on the bolt. So I will just show you here. Now you see that little one which goes to the nut and then you just flip over the other side to the bolt. Like this. This is the most important thing to make sure that your propeller will stay on the sail drive in combination with the Loctrite prepared bolts that you will follow in the box. So now we install the plates. Now it is important that this one goes where the bolt is going to be locked inside.
Now you use the Allen wrench that also comes inside the box when you get your propeller. Make it good and tight. So now they are tightened and now you see that you have the problem that you cannot open the blades because they are too tight but the composite hub is built so it will lock the bolts even though you are going to release the bolts a little bit around 45 degrees on both bolts to start with like this. Make sure to do it exactly the same on both bolts, so you make sure that both blades will go freely. Like this. If it's a little too tight, release a little bit more, it will still stay locked. But remember to do it exactly the same on both sides. So now you have your propeller move freely and you are almost good to go in the water. All you need now is the cosmetical things like this one. And you are good to go with your propeller.